A non-storm related news story. A federal jury today found a Macon businessman accused of bribery, conspiracy and money laundering not guilty on all counts. Clifford Whitby left the court a free man after the verdict, hugging his wife and daughter. Also acquitted a Florida lawyer, Harold Knowles, accused of handling bribe money. The jury deliberated for less than three hours. The prosecution alleged Whitby paid more than $400,000 to Romaine Dolliman, Bibb County's former school superintendent. In exchange, Dolliman agreed to provide school support to a program headed by Whitby. Dolliman testified against Whitby, and prosecutors played a secret recording of the two men apparently discussing bribe money. But defense lawyers called Dolliman a crook and a liar who blamed Whitby for his own troubles. Whitby says he's grateful the jurors didn't, didn't as he put it, drink the Kool-Aid. Thank God for um, giving us the strength as a family uh, to get through this process. Um, second, I want to thank this great, great legal team uh, led by Nick Latito, our local counsel. Brian Gerard. Our local counsel, Brian Gerard. The Bibb County school system still has a multi-million dollar civil suit pending against Whitby, Dalamond, and others accusing them of defrauding the school district.